Two former Donna school board members will be back in federal court tomorrow. CBS 4's Annalise Ortiz is live to tell us what we can expect from that hearing. Annalise. Former school board trustees Eloy Infante and Elpidio Yanez are expected to be sentenced tomorrow here in federal court. Now, this is in connection with a public corruption case, which was yet another scandal that has rocked the small school district of Donna ISD. A federal corruption case will soon be closed for two former trustees of the Donna School District. Elpidio Yanez and Eloy Infante are expected to be sentenced Tuesday and are facing up to 20 years in prison. The men pleaded guilty to a charge of attempted interference with commerce by extortion. An indictment that was brought against the men in 2015 states that they attempted to extort and accepted bribes from a person whose company provided services to the school district. The indictment states that Yanez and Infante told the service provider that he must pay each of them $10,000 in order to keep a contract with Donna ISD. According to court documents, Yanez and Infante accepted a plea agreement. As a result, the government will recommend that two charges be dismissed during sentencing. Both men have since resigned from the school board. Trustees David De Los Rios and Dennis Ramirez have taken their places. The district will also see a new superintendent after Jesus Reina resigned just last week. Juan Adrián Guerrero, who was accused of being the middleman in connection with this bribery and extortion scheme, is also expected to be sentenced tomorrow. He pleaded guilty to the same charge. Live in McAllen, Annalise Ortiz, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.